Sziasztok! Itt vagyunk az idei V4 Future Esport Fesztiválon, és Bogdánnal fogunk beszélgetni. Please welcome our viewers! Hello viewers and welcome to V4 Future Sports Game. My name is Bogdan, also known as Bender Shield Cosplay, and I welcome you all here. It's nice to have you here. Tell me a little about yourself. What are you doing in your free times? Well, most of my free time is devoted to cosplay. I'm from Serbia, but cr currently living in Croatia. And I try to do as much as cosplay as I do and to try to turn cosplay, not in just a hobby, but into a profession. How long have you been doing this? About uh, three, maybe four years. I started maybe five, five years ago, but building costumes for other people. Uh, only recently I started building costumes for myself. What was your, uh, I mean, your first cosplay that you made? Uh, my first cosplay was uh, Thor in Oaken Shield in 2015. I made it for the premiere of the movie, The Hobbit Battle of Five Armies, and I won a few contests with it and went to a few conventions outside, and it was fun making it and being Thorin. What's your biggest achievement that you are proud of? Well, you see it. Right here it's Geras Vakarian from Mass Effect Trilogy. Uh, the armor is from the third instance of the game. And I spent about six, maybe seven months building it and then additional two, maybe three months in uh, repairing it and maintenance and all things that, and upgrading it generally. Uh, do you have any special, special part of the cosplay that you are like making the most? Oof. Um, I just love spending my time in my workshop. It doesn't matter what it is, crafting or painting or sewing. I just love being in my workshop and working on a prop or a costume. It doesn't matter the technique. Is this your workshop uh, like in your apartment or it's somewhere else? Well, uh, currently is at my fiance's apartment, a little room that we have. But back home it's a tiny little room where I spend most of my free time. Does your fiancé also doing cosplay? Oh yeah, she's out there somewhere in a vault suit with 111 on her back and a big boy on her arm. Do you make cosplays like together or are you just doing it separately? We work on several costumes at a time. She works on her own, I work on my own, but uh, sometimes we just, you know, I help her do something on her costume, she does something on mine. So we interchange. Is there any special part that uh, she's good in it than you or vice versa? Well, she's great at painting and details, little details. She did this sexy scars here. And um, I'm good at uh, lighting, uh, using little LEDs for lights. So when you have light on her costume, that's my doing. If you have something like this, that's her doing. Uh, do you plan making another, I don't know, it's really a couple cosplay? Or we have an uh, ambitious plan, but that will take us a few years to make uh, Deathclaw from Fallout game. I would be a Deathclaw, she would be a Vault Dweller. But that's something that will take us a lot of space and a lot of time. And uh, we have a couple of cosplay plans, but we, are not, we have not decided yet what to do together. Do you have any... Um, favorite movies or mm, games or anything like that that you are like making cosplays from? Well, obviously, Mass Effect is one of my favorite games, obviously. And uh, movies that I like, of course, Star Wars. I plan to do a couple of Star Wars characters. But most of my favorite movies don't have cosplays. I mean, how, what can I cosplay for 2001 Space Odyssey? I mean, really, can I be a monolith? <laughs> Not really, yeah. If you should give advice for somebody who recently started making cosplays, what would it be? Uh, work, work and more work. There is no substitution for experience. You just keep working, keep trying. If you fail, you can always try again. But if you do not attempt, you will not, you're not going to succeed. So just keep working on yourself and your skills and you will improve during time. Have you been? in Hungary before or is this your first? Oh yes, I love being in Hungary. If I could, I would move to Budapest tomorrow. I've been uh, on Mondokon on several occasions, on Play IT on several occasions, on Hungarokon I was also judged last year. Um, I spent 
New Year's Eve here, so yeah. <laughs> I love really being in Budapest. So we thank you for your interview and enjoy your stay. Kiss you, Seppin. Kiss you. See you.